All right, this is a Xbox 1.4 power board, and I got to replace these capacitors. So the best way to cut all this white stuff off of it is with a razor blade. And I'm just like putting the razor on there like it is, and then pressing down on it. But just kind of like press down like that, and wiggle it out. It's pretty easy to cut with a razor. Now, I've already tested these capacitors. And the ones that I got marked with the black uh, marker on top are bad. I believe these two right here are completely dead. This one, I got it marked halfway because I think it's working halfway. These right here are reading about 47 UF and they're supposed to be 100 UF. These on the side. So, anyways, I'm replacing these. I'm replacing, I'm replacing all the ones with the black marker on them. This guy over here, right here, he's still good. So I didn't put anything, didn't mark him with a marker, but I might go ahead and replace him because I have a capacitor for it. Using these uh, capacitors right here, they're 2200 UF, 10 volt. They're supposed to be Panasonic's. I believe they're 10 millimeters by 27 millimeter, and they're supposed to be a 10,000 have 10,000 hours of usage. Which I don't know if that was a misprint or what, because it says 105 volts on them. Usually 105 volts is a thousand hours. So, anyways, they're supposed to be 10,000 hour capacitors. So that's what's replacing those green ones. And then I got these little bitty ones right there. Those are the one 100 US. So let me get this started. Yeah, you just slide the razor blade in between them like this. Like I said, this card's there to protect it. I got them already cut loose and then you can see it kind of wiggling so anyways they're ready to come out now this is the very last capacitor the last 2200 I'm testing as you can see here it says it has a 1980 UF that sounds pretty good but it's supposed to be 2200 if it's missing less than 10%, you're supposed to replace them, so, yeah. Alright, I just uh, got through desoldering these 100 UF capacitors. One went here, another one went right here. And there they are. It's those two. But they're both 100 UF, 25 volt. And here's some new ones right here that are the same. So... What I gotta do now is clean all this white paste. All right, I already got these 100 UF capacitors installed. This is kind of hard to see, but you see these long wires sticking out right here and here. I haven't trimmed them off yet, but uh, yeah, I got it installed. I'll flip it over. That's what I do is put those two in there. Okay, I pulled all these capacitors off. I just got done recapping this whole board here. There's my solders. And I can see them. 